Hi, I'm Ben with IWS Sales, and today I'm here to talk to you about a 2023 ATC Quest Car Hauler Limited. And before I really get into the details of this trailer, I first wanna tell all of our subscribers, thanks for your patience with us. Uh, it's been a little hard to get inventory. I know a lot of you have been asking for some videos. Uh, we got a lot of new exciting things to share with you. Um, but since we haven't had much inventory, we didn't feel it was responsible to do a bunch of video shoots. So we got some now and we're excited to go. So let's go ahead and just get right into it about this car hauler. The ATC Quest Car Hauler Limited. This is the nicest trailer we can get from ATC. This is what we would call our IWS Signature Series trailer. So this is what you know me and my dad order for ourselves. This isn't our trailer exactly. This one's actually for sale, but this is something we would order for what we would use to take our cars to Barrett Jackson, what we haul our performance vehicles in. In fact, we're gonna give you a little bit of a sneak peek into our new performance vehicle line of Hennessy vehicles. We have our Ford Bronco Velociraptor here today. We're gonna show that to you loading in and out of this car hauler today. Cause I know a lot of our customers, a lot of you RVers, you got Jeeps, you got Broncos, you got pickups, you got four wheel drives. And we wanna show you what it's like to load one of these in here. Uh, so we're gonna really show that into you. So stick around for the video. First, we're gonna talk about the exterior today. And I wanna go over a little bit of the, the just some, some tech specs with you. So this trailer advertises a 24 foot interior length. So we call this our 24 foot car hauler. This is our most popular length. And the reason I say that is because, you know, a lot of people are trying to sit, keep a trailer as short as possible, but just because of how long vehicles are nowadays, 24 foot inside is really what you're looking for. And when we go inside, I'll show you that there's about two feet of cabinet space inside, and that's gonna take away two feet. So you only have 22 feet of usable space inside of this 24 foot trailer. So, but we'll get into a little more of that. Overall length, if you're looking for that, for some of you RVers that are trying to keep it short, this is a, about a five foot tongue. So this trailer is just under 29 foot in overall length. The overall height of this is nine foot six inches, and the interior height is seven foot, and we'll give you some more shots of that later. The width, this is an eight foot wide trailer, or eight and a half foot wide, I should say. So this is the legal width. Um, there's no uh, over width permit needed for this. This is a perfect uh, ready to go trailer without any permits needed. This is ready to go. One of the things that you'll need to know about this trailer is that it's, it has 6,000 pound torsion dexter axles and the gvwr on this is 13,200 pounds what a lot of you are really wanting to know is how heavy this trailer is and the advantage of atc for those of you that don't know atc it stands for aluminum trailer company so atc is everything aluminum this trailer is 100 percent aluminum except for the axles that's the only thing that's steel in this whole in this whole thing there's no wood in this trailer um, and so this keeps it extremely light this trailer is exactly 3,900 pounds on the MSO. So that's what its shipping weight is sitting here today is 3,900 pounds. So you got about 9,000 pounds of car cargo carrying capacity in this thing, which is a ton. Uh, so with all of you that have heavy pickups, heavy four wheel drives, you can carry this thing in here. So that's a huge advantage to ATC, all aluminum trailers, not just the weight carrying capacity, but also the, uh, this should be your last trailer you have to buy. <laughs> the only thing you'd have to worry about even rusting is your axles underneath. And those are the only things that are steel. So you got a really robust trailer. But enough of the tech specs, let's go ahead and do a walk around. We're gonna show you the front and all around these things and show you some more details about it. One thing I'll just point out is all of the trailers that you'll see IWS spec out is these flat fronts. There's V-nose trailers, there's flat nose trailers. But I'll tell you what, we love the flat nose trailers because it gives you a little bit extra space and ATC stance on it. They did a lot of aerodynamic testing. So a lot of you that want a V nose, ATC stance on it is there's zero aerodynamic advantage of that um, through their testing. So we really like the flat nose front. It saves you having to be a longer trailer and it just makes it a little bit more convenient inside. All ATC Quest Car Hauler Limiteds have the gravel guard here, and this is great for protecting the front of your trailer. Here you'll see that we have a triple tube design. This is 
something that's very unique and something that we you know we're very proud of with atc this is a you know this is a couple inches thick right here and you can see how how deep these are this tongue actually extends a couple feet back into the trailer as well underneath this is a triple tube all welded construction atc really specializes in their construction they have a great uh three-year construction warranty um, they pride themselves in their welds if you look at some of their factory tours you can see how they weld their trailers it's, it's extremely impressive um, and that goes back to the quality we tell you that this is your last trailer you have to buy because with all aluminum and the the weld construction there's there's no need to get another new trailer all right moving right along here so we have our smart jack here and we'll show you a little bit about how this works but all of our trailers come with with some sort of electronic jack this is our favorite one this is what we run on our personal car hauler at home but being able to just run the trailer up and down as you need to and we'll show you a little bit about how the smart feature works where this will actually remember what the height of your pickup is or your motorhome whatever the ball height is you can teach it how to do that and every time you set it down and bring it back up it remembers that height so a very nice jack it's a just it's a quality of life thing again we talk about it a lot but we don't want you to have any regrets when you buy this trailer so that's why we stock our trailers to the nines the signature series trailers are something we would buy for ourselves so we don't want you to have to sit there and crank a jack your whole life. It's just not worth it. So we always order them with electric jack. Moving right along, we have our uh, easy uh, Demco easy lock right here. That's a nice feature for Quest Car Hauler Limiteds. This is an upgraded locking system. No more having to remember a pin, things like that. Just nice and easy. A lot of people ask if our car haulers have a breakaway system, and yes, it does. I've tied it up here just for looks, but this is a breakaway system. So this has four wheel electronic uh, brakes. So if for whatever reason the trailer has come disconnected from your vehicle, you um, will get this thing stopped. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead on the driver's side here and show you a little bit of the exterior features. So when you get a Quest Car Hauler Limited, you get 040 aluminum sidewalls. A lot of you might not know what that means, but what I can tell you is it's a thicker sidewall. These are all aluminum sheeted panels here. and that way if you you know we can get this in different colors you know a white or black or gray or silver and we can even wrap it to match your coach <laughs> but what we like about that is if you've seen trailers going down the road that have a bunch of dimples and waves in it you don't get that with the atc quest car hauler limited because of how thick the sidewalls are the other advantage of the ATC sidewall, I'll just tell you, is with this aluminum sheeting is, gosh, you know, if something happens, if somebody does dent it, these are really easy to replace. You can just peel them off. They're just bonded by VHB uh, bonding tape, which is uh, made by 3M, and it's very, very easy to replace. So that's, so again, going from the construction quality and simplicity, this is a really well-built trailer. Moving around the top, you'll see that ATC does these rounded corners, which just gives you a nice look. You'll notice if you start looking at other trailers that are a little bit uh, more on the entry level, you don't get some of these nice features like the rounded corners, um, this, this aluminum siding. And even when you look down at the bottom of the trailer, all the way down here, this is what we call our perimeter skirting. And it's really mostly an aesthetic thing because um, most trailers just look flat along the bottom, uh, but they angle it down so you get some more ground clearance in front and behind the, the uh, tires. Salem vents, a lot of you are probably wondering what this is. This is a Salem vent and there's one on the passenger side as well. And the idea behind this is when you open this vent up, you got to open it from the inside. Like a lot of our customers and like, like us, we off-road race and we have a lot of fuel on board. And when you're carrying fuel, it can really vent inside of there and it really smells like gas. So the idea behind Salem vents is as you're going down the road, you get some airflow in here to escape the fumes. It's just a nice feature. Again, just quality of life things that ATC has thought about. So moving right along down the trailer, I wanna talk about the tires and wheels, okay? And the, the biggest thing that I can tell you about these is, you know, 
we're putting, you know, ATC specking a really nice tire. This is a Goodyear endurance tire. This isn't some cheap tire that you got to go ahead and replace the moment you buy it on the lot, which most trailer competitors do. With the Goodyear endurance, you know, this is their highest quality tire that we can put on. So you can have confidence that what you're buying is a good tire. Because a lot of you I know are carrying your, your, your prized possessions inside of this. You don't want to have to have a uh, tire blowout on you just because you have cheap tires. The other thing I'll say is these are riding on Dexter torsion axles. And most trailers that you see are riding on a leaf spring suspension. Dexter torsion axles are a premium option for you. And this comes standard on a Quest Car Hauler Limited. Um, but the way that torsion axle works is, is really the biggest advantage is they're going to give you a lot better ride quality than, uh, say, a leaf spring. And when you're going down the road, the Dexter torsion axles give you a lot better suspension. And when you're trying to protect your cargo, it's going to give you a lot better ride and, and you're not going to get so much jarring up and down. Um, if you do a little bit more research on Dexter, you can see a lot of their advantages over a leaf spring axle. But that's just something that ATC is looking at. And a lot of people don't think about, how's my trailer going down the road? I'm just towing it, but how's my cargo doing back there? When you have torsion axles, you can have some good peace of mind there. Okay, now the moment I'm sure you've all been waiting for, you're wondering what the heck is this big door doing on the side of it? This is something that really sets ATC apart from the competition and really why we chose ATC as our premier car hauler for our personal car collection, our performance vehicles, um, and what we wanted to sell to our customers. This premium escape door makes it so that you can uh, carry your car in here without having to have a winch or if you're by yourself you can load your car so the idea is is that when i'm loading my car by myself i can just open this door here and i have access to the trailer this fender actually comes out and i can set this aside so again i would do this before i load my vehicle but the idea is that as i'm loading a car in i can go ahead and get out all right now that we showed you the magic of the premium escape door we're just going to go ahead and keep moving right along one thing to notice is this is actually a side marker light so it's just for your turn signals it's just a little bit of a light there for when you turn your turn signals on this comes on right here it's really nice for when you're towing this thing you can just see that activate and know that your turn signals are working the last thing on this side that I really need to show you is, you know, ours come with docking lights and these docking lights are for when you're backing up, let's say at night, these will illuminate the side of the road for you so you can look out and have some confidence when backing up at night. Okay, moving right on to the back here, I want to show you some cool features about this thing. At the top, you'll notice that we have a spoiler, and that's great for looks. It's on all of our Quest Car Hauler Limiteds. It's a, it's a great look, but there's a lot of functionality to this thing, too. You'll see that we have three LED scene lights along the top of this thing, and that's great for when you're loading your vehicle at night or just using the trailer at night. It really illuminates it. They're a, they're a great light. What makes ATC special is just their attention to detail. So most trailers have an ugly clasping lock of some sort, but ATC has this really premium door handle right here that you just easily open and uh, there's a padlock here but it's just really smooth looking it's really easy to use and just a great function and it's on both sides of the trailer the other thing important to mention about ATC is their their marker lights and their backup lights and turn signals ATC does these really nice long big turn signals here that are able to be seen by a small passenger car that's trailing behind you they're really easy to see very bright and visible and they're not some cheesy light this is our true led light that uh, really illuminates and all of our marker lights that are along the trailer are led very nice high quality lights now let's talk about the ramp door and what makes it so cool so again some some tech specs here for you this is a as i mentioned before seven foot interior height car hauler so the door is 84 inches long and it's 90 inches wide so it, it's going to fit a lot of your vehicles that you need to and give you a lot of clearance the vehicle load so this trailer's vehicle load is 4,000 pounds so what that means is when the car is rolling on at any given time on top of the trailer it can weigh 
4,000 pounds. So um, it's a very heavy duty door. You'll see some videos that they have where they've loaded skid steers that are heavier than 4,000 pounds. But of course, stick with their recommendation of a 4,000 pound load. We're gonna go ahead and open this thing up. So as I open the trailer, you're gonna notice that it has this nice easy transition flap right here. And it, it's all extruded aluminum here on this ramp door, um, which is a very nice deal. And if you have a super low profile car, um, IWS can sell you some race ramps as well. We have to do that for some of our really, really low stuff. Okay, moving on over to the other side of the trailer. I'm gonna show you the exterior. Again, we have our docking lights. And one thing I wanted to mention too, is that at the bottom of this trailer, you'll notice that you have these uh, jacks right here. Now these are just a stabilizing jack that you would put down when you're loading a car or something like that at the racetrack or um, you would put these down. We're connected to a pickup so we don't have them down right now. I mentioned a lot about lights just because we love them so much when we're at the racetrack, but up top you'll see these LED scene lights. We have two of them on this side and they're angled down. They're a really nice light. So again, you're loading a car at night, you're working on something at night, you're at the racetrack at night, whatever it is. Okay, so moving right along here. Next thing is we got two exterior outlets here and these are 110 outlets. There's a, there's a 50 amp shore cord service on this so you can power some outlets here if you need to or if you have a generator on board, uh, power this for your work site or your uh, race site. Next, let's talk about the door, okay? This is a 34 inch wide entry door and it's a nice door that's got a deadbolt on it and it does have a locking mechanism here so that way you can keep it locked in the wind. Don't have to worry about that. And what's really nice, just again, what ATC thinks about is they have this nice security step here so that it's really nice and easy to load inside of the trailer and out. Uh, that way you're not, you don't know, have to make this huge step. Most trailers do have that, they don't have a step. Now that we showed you everything on the exterior, I wanna go ahead and let's go inside and show you all the interior features and what makes this thing so cool. Okay, so here we are, we're inside the trailer and there's a lot to talk about. So just go ahead and stay with me here. I'll go ahead and talk about the front here and let's talk about this cabinet construction. This is not a standard cabinet package, but this is our cabinet package we like to order for our signature series trailers. And the reason I say that is because we actually use these trailers and we know what it's like and what cabinets you need. So when I'm talking about these drawers here, we love these because it carries our tools with us or just, you know, those things that just need to go in a drawer. Uh, many, uh, you know, many cabinets, many trailers don't come with the drawers. This is just such a nice upgrade. The other thing is we order it with this closet insert right here. And it's, it, sure, it's a short insert, but it's nice for hanging up some shirts or, you know, anything like that. And it's got a little shelf up top here. Just some convenience feature there. Along the top, we have extra storage too. Just go ahead and open them all for you. And right here is where we have our uh, shore cord service. This is where we have all of our uh, breaker switches and um, our master battery disconnect. But this is where you can put race helmets on things up there. We also have this LED light, which is really nice for if you're working here. And of course, we just have a nice countertop here as well. Um, and IWS, we have a nice pegboard system we can sell you that can go back here um, where we can mount tools and things here for you as well. And we have a nice outlet, just convenience thing. This is a truly a workstation. And when you think of it from an investment standpoint, it's nice to have this storage. Um, you know, considering how expensive it is to build buildings nowadays, you could use this at your at your home or uh, you know at your business to store cars, store things in. It's a lot cheaper than trying to build a building. Um, going along to the bottom of the cabinets here, there's a ton of storage in here, and. Stepping down here, you'll notice that we have a shelf, which is great, but really some of the cool things is these, these trailers do come with an AGM battery. Many trailers don't come with a battery or they come with some cheesy battery. This is a pretty nice 12 volt AGM battery. And I mentioned that with the premium escape door that you don't have to have a winch, but there are some cars that 
uh, you know, if you're going to go find some barn finds, they don't run. So you do need a winch. <laughs> um, and so we spec this trailer with a uh, come up winch here. And this is a 5,000 pound winch with a synthetic rope. And it also comes with a wireless remote. So talking about after all the cabinets there, uh, moving right along into the trailer. As I mentioned, this is a seven foot interior height trailer. And they came up with seven foot because that's going to fit most of your vehicles that you need. Um, you know, many of our customers that are in the RV industry are towing some sort of Jeep or maybe a Ford Ranger or a Ford Bronco or something like that, a smaller rig. But this is tall enough for, you know, an F-150 um, or, you know, a Chevy 1500, something like that. A full size pickup would fit in here as long as it doesn't have, uh, you know, big monstrous tires or a big lift, but a very convenient size here. And the vent here, this is just a vent here, but this is prepped for an air conditioner. That is an option if you want to order it from us or something that we could retrofit for you. It's throwing an air conditioner here. So if you're using this at the racetrack, you can have one there. It's all prepped for you. From a styling perspective, ATC does this really nice finish. Of course, we have the aluminum sidewall construction, but they finish this cove is what we call this. This is a cove. It's all finished and the ceiling's all finished. When you step in an ATC, you just know that you've stepped up a level, you know, in terms of quality and finish. Um, and it's really just something that you're going to feel good about when you have your investment in here or your prized possessions. So I'm going to go ahead and talk to the side here. Um, this was the Salem vents that I mentioned earlier, and I just want to show you how they operate because it's important that you know. But the way that they would work is you would open this one here um, and you have a open into the outside and then so walking back, this is how this system fully operates as you go to this one and operate it that way. And the idea is that now as I'm going down the road, I get some sort of airflow through here to try to make that fume smell go away. It's a really nice thing. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about just some of the floor construction and, and, and some of the mechanics of how this trailer is gonna work. But on these Quest Car Hauler Limited, this is our most premium flooring. This is what we call an extruded aluminum flooring. So this is actually made of all just aluminum. It's extruded. <laughs> um, and the reason this is such a nice floor is because, like I mentioned earlier, there's no wood underneath this. So there's no particle board. There's no uh, sealed poly flooring. There's none of that. It's just what it is. This is extruded aluminum. And underneath of it is aluminum. So as I mentioned, that's just what it is. And when we mentioned that this is the last trailer that you'll have to buy is because of this extruded aluminum. Um, I'm not worrying about uh, thrashing this. Um, I could take this to Moab and thrash it with some off-road rigs and I can also put our uh, show Mustangs inside of this thing. Uh, it's, it's work and play. And from a convenience standpoint, you know, after a long weekend, it's nice to know that I have a trailer that I can just rinse out with a pressure washer um, and not have to worry about tearing it up or anything like that. So this is something you can really thrash and, and really enjoy. Now we're going to talk a little bit about the how to tie down a vehicle. And this is really the magic behind ATC and what makes them special is the airline track system that we have them put in here. So now I want to talk about some of the magic behind ATC and what a lot of people don't really know about trailers from ATC is our airline track system versus a traditional D-ring style system. Most trailer manufacturers um, have never loaded a car inside of them. <laughs> um, and the reason I say that is because many manufacturers only use this stationary D-ring system. And many of you probably own a trailer and only have these. And that's okay if you have one vehicle that you use every time. But a lot of our customers have multiple vehicles or they're using this for their business and they have multiple different uses. And when you just have, you know, let's say four or five D-rings or even if you had 10, you still don't have unlimited amounts of options. You, you're, you're fixed to putting your tie down straps where these are bolted to the floor. So while we have these here, airline track um, gives you a lot more flexibility and let me show you why so we have airline track mounted all around the floor here on the sides of the v of the trailer and we have it mounted to the wall as well and i'll talk about that in a second but airline track is built for those of you that have multiple cars and 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 things like that 
And we have these different attachment points that we can sell. Yeah, these are from Max Tie Downs, our friends up in Max Tie Downs, um, that we use to tie down vehicles. And what's so nice about having these different attachments here, and I have some here, you have different varieties, but this is this particular attachment that I have in my hand is built for a, a, a large vehicle. But I can put this attachment anywhere that I want, and I can slide it anywhere that I want to put this. So, you know, you're going to have different cars or different vehicles, or you know, um, we have my uncle. He owns a Chevron station. He uses it to to haul lots of cargo. He doesn't even use it for a car. Um, this gives you so many options and there's no sense in struggling and dealing with just the D-rings when you have the airline track system. And ATC will just put these ones in the floor from you. At IWS, if you need more, we can put some in the floor for you as well for your specific car as well. You can get a hold of our sales staff to uh, make sure we fit your car specifically to what you're looking for because um, we can add much more airline track to the floor. But without airline track, I mean, I'll go as far as to tell you that me and my dad, Chuck, we will not own a trailer unless it has airline track in the floor and on the wall. It's just an absolute must. And for those of you that have struggled with just having D-rings, I feel for you. This is to make your life so much easier, I promise. Now I want to talk about airline track on the wall and why that's so cool. Many people don't understand why you would do airline track on the wall. You're always just thinking about the car. But when you do that, you've really limited all your space to just the floor. So at ATC and IWS, we've decided that there's so much more potential in these. And with having airline track on the wall, it allows me to be able to tie something to the wall. Um, you know, we, we have a friend that owns a, a furniture store and when he's hauling his furniture in and around, he can use a strap like this and he can tie something to the wall with these uh, attachment points. So, so, and man, I'm telling you, it just, you know, a lot of our RV customers, you, you know, you go to a, uh, you know, you're going to a different, show or something across the country and you brought your trailer with you it's so frustrating if you have something long and tall and skinny uh, to not be able to just easily tie it down if you got your jeep or your bronco in here this just gives you so much more versatility it also gives you a great spot to tie down your straps and while i'm talking about straps i'll mention our friends max tie downs um, we use max exclusively with our trailers and uh, they have 10,000 pound straps is what we use for all of our performance vehicles um, you can talk to our sales staff and we have multiple different strap options and we have multiple different attachment points for your ATC trailer. So give us a call. We'll be happy to outfit you um, in, in any way that you need. Um, but we, uh, just to talk a little bit about IWS, it started, uh, the name started with Idaho Wrecker Sales. We've been in the towing business for over 20 years. And so uh, towing and trailers, towing vehicles, securing them down, that's where we've made our living for years. So um, talk to one of our specialists to talk about how to secure your vehicle to your trailer um, the best possible way. Okay, we're gonna keep moving on back to the trailer, but one thing I wanted to point out too is, you know, ATC specs are really nice LED light on the top and most trailer manufacturers really neglect lighting uh, when you're inside the trailer. These are really high quality LED light on the ceiling. So um, just wanted to point that out as well. A lot of people want to know how wide is it between the fender wells and this is 81 inches right here between these fender wells and one thing to just kind of keep in mind is with this removable fender well um, you can get your car in here with that out and then if your car has a long enough wheelbase you can fit the fender in between the tires so you can play with that and it gives you some flexibility with that removable um, fender. Now, moving here, we have the uh, spare tires mounted right here to the wall, um, which is really nice. So, and it's towards the back of the trailer. So even if you had to, you know, change the tire out, you got it right here in the back where it's accessible and you might not have to take your car out for that. The last thing to really point out about the interior is the, this right here is an integrated beaver tail and it might be hard to catch it on camera, but you can see the floor is flat and then it starts angling down. And that's really ATC's design factor to give you a taller door and a better load angle for when you're loading a low car um, and just give you that better 
um, space. They really recognize that. Many trailer manufacturers don't have this. So what ends up happening is if this is the back of your trailer, you have a very steep ramp door. So with the beaver tail, you're gonna really angle it back out here um, for a nice loading angle. I really just wanted to get a quick plug in about our Hennessy performance vehicles. This one is a extra wide Bronco. It's got the Sasquatch package, but Hennessy also put 35 inch off-road tires and their 20 inch wheels on it. Um, it's got a little bit of a lift on it. It's extra wide. It's about uh, 81 wide from the tire. So it's gonna just fit in this trailer, but we wanna show that to you. This Bronco has 400 horsepower that's upgraded from 300 uh, by Hennessy. Um, and it's got the Velociraptor package on it with off-road uh, bumpers, lights, uh, wheels and tires of both. As I already mentioned, the lift kit. Um, it's a really awesome machine. So we're very proud to see it go. All right, that's gonna wrap it up for us today. And we just got done with the exterior, the interior. I hope it, you found it informational. And uh, I wanna say thanks again for subscribing to our YouTube channel and watching it. Um, but before I end, I did wanna tell you guys the price of this trailer, because I know a lot of you are gonna ask that. The trailer that we saw today as equipped is $57,500. And that's a no kidding, that's a real sell price. So you can call us and we would sell it to you for that today. We have many other ATC trailers in stock, ready to go at the time of this video. We have different lengths, colors, anything that you need. So give us a call. We'll be glad to get you in the right trailer and uh, figure out what the best one is for you. And also wanted to just say, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, like, comment, and also turn on the notifications so that you're the first one to know about uh, when we release a new video. Uh, we plan on doing a bunch more videos this year, uh, especially with the performance vehicles. If you haven't already checked out our orange TRX video, uh, that's awesome. And we're gonna just do a lot more vehicles. So we got a lot more fun coming. Please stay tuned and uh, thanks again. And we'll see you out on the road.